The bodies of three of the four divers who were sucked into a 36-inch underwater crude oil pipeline off Point Appear last Friday have been removed to the Forensic Sciences Center. TTT News understands the bodies were taken to forensics this morning under pending identification and an autopsy to determine the cause of death. The announcement of the recovery made by Paria Fuel Trading Company in a statement on Monday evening. Christopher Budram, Faisal Kurban, Rishi Nagasa, Kazim Ali Jr. and Yusuf Henry were doing maintenance work on the pipeline when the tragedy occurred last week. Budram was rescued that same day by diver Ronald Ramuta, a relative to Kurban. He is in stable condition at the San Fernando General Hospital. Attempts to retrieve the fourth body are still ongoing. Meanwhile, Paria Fuel Trading Company is denying that the body of the fourth diver has been found, as is being stated by Oilfield Workers Trade Union executive member Ozzy Warwick. Paria says all the affected families continue to be informed with timely updates, and earlier this morning were advised that recovery operations will continue relentlessly until the fourth body is found. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley has expressed condolences to the loved ones of the four divers who lost their lives while on technical duty at Paria facilities in the Gulf of Paria. Dr. Rowley gave the assurance to the families that nothing will stand in the way of determining how the tragedy occurred. He committed that everything will be professionally executed by Paria and its associates in this matter, starting with the already announced independent investigation involving the best professional and technical expertise available to the country. The Prime Minister called upon citizens to be caring and comforting during this time.